for that reason, but obviously, I also love sports. So, here we go, Erin is here, and Heather, yay, welcome everybody. So, we are gonna get it done in 35 minutes. It is gonna be fun, it's gonna be silly. We will use some weights for a few things if you have them, if you don't have them, it is no big deal at all. There's just a few things that we're gonna add them in because we can, so if you have weights, keep them close by. Otherwise, a lot of it, most of it will be no equipment. Brittany is here for the BC. Yay, has her 13 month old. Yep, I get it. Whitney made it to a live. Mommy D, awesome. And Katie. Yay, guys. All right, so obviously you know the drill. Be where you are today. All you gotta do is show up. If you showed up today, you are successful. That is how I feel about those Olympic athletes. They just show up, but obviously they're there to win as well. Kirsten is here, yay. Oh, sister live. All right, team, so make sure you have some space. Natalie, hi, Natalie. Make sure that you have your water. I know it's hot for a lot of us. It's gonna be hot when you're wearing the sweatband <laughs> instead of my headband. Anyway, all right, and then of course, like all of our lives, at the end, I will grab my computer, I will say hi. We will have a little chat. If there are any questions that you have, you can add them in at the end. So hang out if you can. All right, should we do it? Kurt, can you get my timer there too? Awesome, guys. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start just warming up. I just want you to just do a little march or a jog, whatever is good for you, shake it all out. Good morning, Jen and Chelsea, yay! So many friends from my body fit athletic club. Roll those arms. Woo, sportscaster 89 in South Florida. Awesome, this should be right up your alley, assuming you are a sportscaster. All right, team, so we're gonna get a warm up with a few sports. Let's take it to tennis. So we're just gonna reach back, take it here, reach back, take it here. I want you to think about opening up. You can make it a little more of this open or you can really get into it, right? We're gonna get silly today, we're gonna have fun. But the goal, of course, as always, is just to get moving. So a few more with our tennis swings. Yes, roll them out. Let's walk out to our inchworm. Woo, out to here. I can promise you one thing. Every Olympic athlete does some version of a plank. <laughs> and a lot of strength training. Take it out one more time. If that is right for you, bring it here. Arms up, little swing. Hi, Lamore in Israel. Katie is here. Let's open it out. Into that side lunge, you know it. One more each way. 
and then let's roll through our back and round it up. I'm feeling tight and sore today. I filmed a lot of workouts this week. Take those knees out. So I gotta get moving. Yay, yes, Chelsea, let's get silly. Hi. Oh, good, I'm glad you like the music. Kurt picked it specifically for today. Obviously, we don't have the rights to the Olympic theme, otherwise I would wanna do it. <laughs> Bring it in, round it up, let's tap and reach across. All right, team, so we are gonna go through several quick little circuits. Some will be a little bit longer, some will be quick. No repeat today. We're just gonna get it done and go through so many of our favorite Olympic sports, right? We're not gonna worry about time. We're just gonna get it done. I'll watch the clock, you don't have to. Let's take them up. And breathe. I'm gonna grab a quick sip of water, realizing I did not have enough water today. You keep going with those hamstrings. All right, team, so get silly with me. Do what you can. As always, I will give you modifications. So you do you, be where you are today. Whatever type of Olympic athlete you are, that's where you are and you are here. We are all getting the gold today. Let's take it across right here. All right, so go ahead. I'm gonna adjust my fan. Hi, Alana from the Philippines. Woo. All right, warm. Okay, guys, shake it out. We are starting with our track and field, which I think is technically called athletics in the list woo, of Olympic events. Adjusting my mic. All right, so we're gonna start with our race walk, which is that power walk, right? This is an actual sport and it is fascinating to watch because they are so good. They know exactly how to go really fast without running. So we're here, take it quicker. Yay, Karina is here. Is gonna do it soon. Andrea, first time doing the live. So Lord, thank you for coordinating my outfit today. All right, so then if you want, you can keep it here. You can be a race walker. But if you want, let's take it to a distance runner. So just a jog. Although when we watch, when I watch even the marathoners on the Olympics, they look like they're sprinting, right? Their distance run is faster than my sprint. So, ah! Speaking of sprinting, let's pretend that we're getting the 200 or the 300, no, 200 or 400 meter dash, or you're on a relay. Woo! Let's take it to a sprint. If that is too much for you, you can just increase your race walk or keep with your distance pace. But if you want, let's be a sprinter. I mean, the Olympians would already be done by now. Let's take it back to our race walk. So we're gonna do one more time. I know, no repeat, but this is still part of it. One more time with your race walk. Lori is representing Team Chicago. Hey, Kayla, I can't wait to see you. When you do this tomorrow, take it to your distance pace. Keep the race walk if that's better for you. And then are you ready? We've got 10 seconds, 100 meter dash. Here we go. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Three, two, one. Tap it out, you did it. Ooh, man, those guys are so fast on the track, I love it. All right, so if you have an option of a weight, I'm gonna grab a dumbbell, I'm gonna grab my 10. <clears throat> I want you to grab it. If you have something lighter, we're gonna keep it in one hand if we can, otherwise you can take it to two. Watch me here, we're gonna do the shot put. You seen the shot put? Throwing. The shot, so we're gonna keep our weight here. We're gonna go in a transverse side lunge, take it here, we're gonna press it up. We're gonna get it all on one side and then we will switch our side. So we're here, tuck it in nice and tight. We're gonna get low to get our power, use our legs, push up with that press. If you don't have any weight, you can grab a water bottle or just do the lower body. Here we go, take it back. Deep transverse, power it up, deep. And up. So I really want you to think about the power. Again, if you have one heavier, you want to put it between two hands. That works too. I'm just trying to make it a little more like that shot put motion, but it doesn't matter. Take it up. Take it down. Power all the way through. Let's get one more. Yes and relax. All right, you're gonna get the same thing other side. So we're getting deep, 
want you to get deep into that side lunge, power off as if you're pushing that shot foot all the way over. They tend to run through it, but we're gonna keep it a little more controlled. All right, here we go. Take it down. Power it up. Take it deep. I know. So offset on the one side is gonna make that core work even harder. Again, if you've got a heavier, you can take it here. And push. Take it here. Jen is representing Team Oregon. I guess that makes me California. Tell me, we'll do it at the end. See how many countries we're representing today. Last one. Whoo, breathe. All right, team, let's take that weight down. How's that heart rate? We're gonna stay here. A little more track and field. How about that long jump? So you know it, they're jumping into the sand pit. Here's what we're gonna do, two options. You can do a nice big step and squat and then walk it back and squat, or you can do a jump and then walk it back. So join me here, long jump. Here we go, power forward. And then walk it back. And then walk it back. If you wanna not jump, just take a big step and get low. Totally fine to be right here. We're still getting the legs working. We're still getting that heart rate. If you can, either way, I want you to use those arms and think about power. Power it forward. Long jump. And walk it back. Here we go. Yes! You're doing it! I guess if we wanted to get technical, we would run into it. But we already did all those runs, right? So we're good right here. Walk it or, or run, or jump it or walk it. Whoo! Let's go 10 more seconds. Long jump, power. One more right here. Yes, breathe. All right, team, catch your breath. Whoo! All right, we're gonna take it to some hurdles. All right, watch me first. You can. Just keep it with a regular lunge. We're just gonna take it down and bring it up. If you are able, watch me. We're gonna bring it down, hurdle it, hurdle it, drive the knee into the chest. So what you wanna think about is pushing off that front leg, which is probably not what you would really do if you were hurdling, but push off that front leg, drive the knee to your chest, lean back. That feels like too much for you. You just do a regular lunge. Are we ready? We're gonna get both sides, Zip up that core, shoulders back, here we go. So start with your lunge, get a feel for it. Then as you're ready, if you want, hurdle, hurdle, Ooh, it's gonna be a balance move, right? Down, down. If you just get here, that's okay too. Your hurdles are lower, doesn't matter. Woo, yes. Keep it going. You got 15 seconds. Almost there. You're just lunging, that's okay too. You're still getting those hurdles from here. But if you can, power it up. Last one. Oh man, right? Feeling those legs. Woo. Breathe. Catch your breath. Same thing, other side. So you can keep a regular lunge. If you can push off, drive that knee in. Otherwise, your hurdle is your lunge. Here we go. So start here, lunge it down and up, all the way through. Then as you're ready, hurdle. Yes, low to high. Drive the knee into your chest as if you're getting over those hurdles. I know it's burning. I know the heart rate is up. But look at that, guys. We're already 10 minutes into this workout. Whew. Bring it up. You got it. Yes. And this is our last track and field. We're gonna get a little core break. Five seconds. Can you get two more? Woo! Yes. Relax, grab a good sip of water, take it down to your mat. Awesome team. If you need to modify, I want you to stay up top. We're going cycling. So you're gonna cycle from here. If you need to modify pre-post CR, 
if you can, join me down on your back. You know it, you love it. We're going to whoo, hug those knees in, get a little stretch. And we're gonna start with just our lower body, so arms up, slow cycle. So this is our distance cycling, right? Take it here. If you need to take it a little higher, if that's easier on your back, go there. Otherwise, if you can get low, get low. Lift those shoulders if you can. We're gonna get more into it. And then let's take it to that track cycling. Have you guys seen that? So we're gonna pick up our pace, but you're gonna keep it controlled. I don't want this. I want just a little quicker. And we're leading into those curves. The track cycling is fascinating to watch because they're so fast. It also gives me the most anxiety because it's just a circle. <laughs> Breathe. All right, back to our distance. Relax your upper body. If you need to, you can also just tap or again, take it to that standing. Working for endurance, right? Pick up your pace, you're getting towards the end. Now let's take it to the track. Finish it out. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, you one, hug it in. Good work, team. Bring it up. All right, we're gonna take it to a swing. All right, so we're gonna make it volleyball. So if you don't have a weight, you're gonna do a squat and that volleyball hit, right? A dig. Is that what I dig? Yeah, man. Not a spike, but you're getting under that volleyball. You can squat it just like this. If you have a kettlebell or a weight, you can take it through the center and this swing is gonna be our volleyball, right? So if you've never done a swing before, I want you to take it just with body weight, squat, and hit the ball. Otherwise, join me for a swing. This is volleyball, roll those shoulders back. I know we're going back and forth between equipment, but kettlebell or dumbbell, swing it back or squat and hit. Here we go. Bring it up. Yes. Power up. Getting that volleyball over the net. So fun to watch again. They're so strong, can jump so high, get under those hits and over. Whichever you're doing, if you're swinging, you're probably going a little quicker. If you're squatting, maybe a little slower. But good form. We got four, three, two, one. Swing and relax. Pedal those feet. Yes, shake it out. How about some gymnastics? All right, guys, so all body weight, or if you want, you can add some weight. Shake that out, keeping those legs working. Here's what we're doing in our gymnastics. We're gonna start on our balance beam. So we're nice and in a straight line. You can do your staggered kickstand deadlift, or you can take it here, again, with or without the weights. I'll do both to show you. Breathe. <clears throat> all right. Let's take it here. So stagger with or without the weights, balance beam, here we go. And again, you can be here, or you can be kickstand, drive up through the glutes. No weights works too. Just think when those girls get low, and guys too, I guess. Do you guys do balance beam? I need to really watch more. I don't think so, right? But then taking your hands over, right? Four more right here. We got four, three, two, one. Relax, let's turn it to that other side. Little stretch if you need it. Again, straight line on your balancing. You can do kickstand, you can do one leg with the without the weights. Here, here you go, take it down. And, or all the way one leg as if you're about to do a cartwheel over that balance beam or a handstand, I guess. And breathe, stretching through the back of the legs. Yes, take it down. And up, Woo! Four more, right here. Four, ah, speaking of balance, I just fell off my beam, right? Three, two, Last one. 
and relax. Yes. Woo. Little stretch if you got it. Staying on that balance beam, I want you to take it nice and deep. Side lunge. Push through. I know we already got a little bit of that with that shot put. Take it here. Down. And up. Four more. Four. Push. Three. Two. Last one. Good. Nice work, team. Right? <laughs> All right, let's take it down to your mat. So if you need to, modification, you're just standing all the way, you're tapping back, tapping in. Otherwise, we're gonna do a plank tuck, as if we're tucking in those somersaults, in those flips. Come up to your hands if you can. Again, modification, you're just tapping it back. Otherwise, you're walking it into that tuck, or you're here. Join me in three, two, one. Here we go. So tuck it in, take it back. You can also walk it in for tuck, tuck, and back. It does not have to be a jump. It's up to you. You do you. Be where you are today at your own pace, but bring those knees in tight as if you're tucking. Here we add a little twist. Tuck to the side. So jump it to the side and back. And back. And back. One more each way. I know. Last one. And breathe. Stretch. Be glad we did that one, guys, because otherwise it was a tuck jump up top. Little, little stretch through your hip flexors. Let's stay down for gymnastics. If you need to modify, you're gonna go up. We're taking it to our uneven bars. We're going to take it with the knees as if we're swinging our legs over the bars. If you can, I want you down on your back. We're gonna take it here, bring it up. Join me in three, standing or down, two, one, here we go, bars, and breathe, and breathe. Take it up, and down, yes! Point those toes, maybe. That's what you'd be doing. Three, two, hold it here nice and tight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, relax, yes. Since we're here, take it over into a side plank. We're gonna bring it all the way up. This is our synchronized swimming, right? So we're gonna take it up, out of the water, drop it down. You can be on your elbow too if that's better for you, on your knee, or across your feet. Synchronized swimming on the side, here we go. Reach up and over, and down. Reach up and over. You can also modify this by standing and just reach. Out of the water, take it down. Yes, through that side plank again. On your elbow or your knee is fine as well if that's better for you. All the way up and reach. Sweatbands are hot. <laughs> Four more right here. Four. Three. Two. Last one. Whoo. Swing those legs, other side. Ah! You guys, 15 minutes left in this workout. We are going so fast. Let's get to that other side. Here we go. We're going to have time to get it all in, I hope. Reach up and down. Coming out of the water. Again, you can be on that knee. And breathe. Good. Or on that elbow, if that's better for you. Use the obliques and the core. Dig it up. Last four, hand or elbow. Four. Three. Woo! Two. Last one, yes! Relax, stretch it back. All right guys, bring it up. Water if you need it. Woo! Breathe. How are we doing, team? Team, woo! Team. Earth, right? <laughs> Let's take it here. All right. Woo. How can we not include this favorite sport, which we actually do in here all the time? Boxing. If you hate boxing, don't worry. It's going to go fast. Let's take it up. Guard is up. Boxer shuffle. You're in the ring. Let's take it with just that jab. One and two. One, two, 
One, two, we'll keep it short, I promise. Take it up, take it up. Yes. Good, double time right here, one and two. Keep it going, yes. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, front jab, jab, jab. Shift your weight, breathe. Here we go, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, take it uppers, upper. Yes! Keep it here or double time, upper, upper. Four, three, two, take it, hooks, hook, hook. Remember that elbow comes high. For four, three, two. Good, bring it here, take it knee. This is our martial arts, right? We got karate, we got taekwondo, I think. Four, three, two. Kick it if you want. You can be low. You can be high. Up. Yes. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Boxer shuffle. Other side. We're going to get all of that really quick. I know we're moving fast. If you just want to do jumping jacks the whole time or some other cardio of your choice, that's okay. Otherwise, guard is up. We'll keep it going fast. Ready. Jabs. Front and back. Yes. Slow. Hup. Double time right here. Here we go. Up, up, jab, jab. You're in the ring. Keep it going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Front jab right here. Out. Yes. Keep it going, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, uppers. Yes. Oh man, clock is ticking guys. This workout is going fast, double. Four, three, two, hooks, up, up and around, protect that face. Almost done with boxing, I promise. Four, Three, two, good. Knees, martial arts. Whoo, breathe. Four more, just your knee, and if you want, you can take it to a kick. Lower high, eight, here we go. Take it eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, woo, shake it out. Let's keep that heart rate going, guys. No weight. We're gonna add it in a minute. Little basketball. We're gonna do quick feet, jump shot. Quick feet, jump shot. You can do it march and up, little squat and up, or here, up. All right, join me. Here we go, quick feet, jump shot. Quick feet, jump shot. Quick feet, up or low impact. Good, shuffle it. Quick feet, jump shot. Quick feet, breathe, hook. One more. Good, dribble it. It's a little plie, right? Through your legs. Woo, get low, even lower. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, shake it out. Whoo! All right, team. How about some rowing, right? If you have weights, grab your weights. If you don't, no big deal at all. We're gonna start with our basic row. So when you think about the crew, the pure rowers, it's here the whole time, right? So we're gonna keep it there. We're gonna start in, and then we'll take it out halfway through. Up to you if you have a kettlebell. Alternate, you got two dumbbells, two dumbbells, otherwise use whatever you've got. Even if that's just your body weight. Shoulders back, pinned it here. Ready, row, nice and strong. Yes, 
breathe. Bring it up. Elbows in, squeeze in those back muscles. Yes. Good. Take it wide right here. Row strong all the way through. Think about those big, whoo, long boats that you're getting across the water so fast. Four more, here we go. Four, three, two, yes. Relax, drop one of those weights down. If you got it, we're gonna take it to our kayaking, but we're gonna curtsy it, watch. Kayak, kayak. Join me, you can go slower than me, as long as you have good form, but we're going with the weight, twisting if that's good for you. Low in that curtsy. Start slow, here we go. And up. And up, all the way through. You can think of it like a little bit of a bicep curl, right? Obviously, we were actually kayaking. We would be a little quicker. Woo! Yes, breathe. All the way. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Good. Have a seat on the floor. If you need to modify, I want you to keep this up top. We're going with our canoe. Breathe. If you're able, join me down here. Lean back here or here, take it here, and up, big arms, slow and controlled, even though we'd be racing, feet up if you want, knees to the side, hook, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, Stretch, yes, good, stretch it out. All right, team, woo! Since we are here, how about we get a little bit of swimming? Grab a sip of water, we are so close. Hmm. Sip of water, down on the ground with me. Let's start on our back. We're actually gonna start with whew, a backstroke. If you need to modify, I want you to take it to that bridge. You're just here to here. If you're able, guys, Legs out, arms out, lift it up. Backstroke, I know, we'd actually be moving our arms to the water. If you can keep those shoulders up, go for it. We won't stay here very long. Again, modification is just a bridge. Take it down and up. But if you can, flutter those feet. Eight, seven, six, pull everything in, in the center, deep core. Four, three, two, Good, take it over. If you're modifying here, I want you to do everything that we're doing. Bird dog, you can do the motion of the strokes, but stay on all fours. If you're able, take it all the way down. We're swimming from here, you know it, up. You can start slow, working through the back, getting the core engaged. This is your freestyle, woo! Keep it going. You wanna just do the kick as if you had a kickboard, that works too, or just the upper body. Four, three, two, breast stroke. Watch me, big arms. Everything comes in. Big arms and legs in. All the way through, lift the shoulders, lift the knees. You don't have to get up super high, just enough. And breathe. Up, bird dog to modify. Four more, almost to that wall. Three. Two, one, stretch it back. Do you guys know there's climbing in the Olympics now, right? Whew. Let's take it to that mountain climber. Bring it up if you can. Again, modification is just a little tap back or standing mountain climber. Oh, we got a lot to get in, but we're gonna do it. Here we go. Mountain climber standing or down on the ground with me here. Run it. Take it to the side. You gotta get around. It's not always straight up. Take it to the side. Or keep it center. Tap it in to modify, or stand it up to modify, but stay with me because we are so close to being done. 
four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stretch it back. Yes. All right, guys. Bring it up. Woo. Catch your breath. All right. Should we do a little weightlifting? It is an Olympic sport, right? All right, so whatever weight you have, I'm gonna go dumbbells. It's up to you, dumbbell or kettlebell. We're just gonna do a squat and a press. Essentially, they're working to get the heaviest weight. Woo! The best lift. All we're gonna do, guys, is take it here, power it up with a clean squat and press. Looks like this. You can hinge, curl, squat, and press or power and up. So clean squat and press or curl squat and press. Join me in three, two, one. Here we go. So curl, squat, press and down. Curl, squat, press where it's a clean. Up. Up. Really strong. Think about getting that power. That's what they're doing with those big barbells. Using their entire body for strength and power to get it up. So keep it going. Oh man, we are so close. Yes. Up. Two more. Last one. Good. How are we doing, team? All right, quick sip of water. Huh. I want you to just jog it out. Whew. All right, guys, guess what? We're gonna do one last bonus move. Making our way to that podium with the gold. Surfing is a new sport in the Olympics. Watch me here. You can just keep it here. Here, here, or here, and here. Or when I tell you, we're falling off the board into our water and we're bringing it up. It's gonna look a little bit like a burpee, but you're gonna love it. All right, ready? Here we go, one minute, surfing. Other side, turn. You can keep it here or fall in the water. Whoo! Bring it up, surf, yes. Keep it going, two more. Oh no, big wave, off the water, up. Here we go. Down in that water. This time we lost our board. We have to swim. Four, three, two, bring it up. Yes, I know. Woo, shaky. Keep it going. Two more. Off your board. Swim to find it. Pop it up on that board. Four, three, Two, one more time. Down and up. On your board. Yes, you win. Right, we did it. Woo! Shake it out. How do you feel, guys? I feel hot and tired. Breathe. Shake out those arms. How's that heart rate? Mine is way up. Whew. Did we get them all in? I think we got most of what I was gonna do today. Shake those arms and legs out. Let that heart rate settle. Whew. One foot forward. You guys seen, especially in those speed sports, when somebody crosses the finish line, they're so out of breath. Most conditioned athletes in the world and they are pushing it to the limit. Whoo, sit back, breathe. Ha, you did it. We all got the gold. Take your knees out and breathe. Ha, thank you guys for showing up today, for having fun, for getting silly, for moving through it really, Quickly, shake those arms out. Let's take those arms forward. Chin to your chest. 
<sighs> Take it up. Sports Catcher 89, what is your favorite part of the Olympic style workout today? I was gonna say that surfing, but now after I just finished it, I'm not sure. I don't know, I love it all. I don't know, I really like that hurdle. I was trying to come up with some way to do hurdles and it just popped into my brain that we could do a lunge with a hurdle in the front, but it wasn't easy, right? Shake it up, press those fingertips down, let your head drop to the side. Heather, thank you for coming. Ha! Heather says, I think I get killed by a shark when I fell off my surfboard. It's possible. Woo! Francis is in California as well. Represent. Woo! All right, team, shake it all out. We can get a few more stretches as we're doing a Q&A. If you need them, whoo, jump up on that podium, reach it up, wave to your country and to the world because you just won the gold. One big deep breath in and out. You did it. That was your Summer Olympics Boot Camp Workout. Great job, everybody. Whoo! I am tired. Hey, Billy, thanks for joining Wendy. Yes, Wendy is so cow like me. Whoo! Yes, thank you. I plan to do more of these. I'm also going to make a lot of short clips for Instagram throughout this week. Ah, yes, Kayla is here. Ah, Charlotte says it felt like the elementary school field day in the best way. Yeah, we need to do more of that, right? Remember field day? Remember elementary school, gym class, PE class? We just ran around and did crazy things, and it was fun. We got to remember that, right? Using our bodies, feeling strong and powerful and fast is fun. Yay, Christina, one of her favorite lies. Ha! Ah, Brittany, 13 months old and the dog climbing you every time. Yep, that's all right. That's how it happened. Dolores, yay! Woo! All right. Ha! Lori totally meddled on that one. Or I did. We all did. All right, team, grab some water. We're going to sit and have a chat. If anybody has any questions, you guys, if there's something I missed, just kind of going through all of the sports, I haven't gotten to watch as much as I would like to. Thank you, thank you. But I am gonna make some short Instagram workouts this week, so let me know if there's something I missed um, that we could add in. No, we could do the bands, we could do archery. Whoo! All right. Let's see. Ah, uh, little baby shark woke up, but happily playing in her crib. Yay, mom, for the win! Ha! Sarah, it's crazy to me that people don't like the boxing it so much fun. I know, I agree, but Everybody doesn't love it, and that's okay. I think some people think you have to be super coordinated, and you don't. You just gotta punch and have fun. So, uh, surfing was hilarious, Jen. I know for me too. Hey, Tamika, thank you. I was trying to be in my um, USA colors. All right, team. Miriam, I'm so glad you set your alarm too. Whew, I don't know what time it is where you are, but. Thank you guys so much. This was such a fun workout to program and such a fun one to do. I felt like even though my heart was pumping the whole time, my legs were burning, I really felt like um, it went really fast because every time I looked up, I thought, oh no, I don't have time to get everything in. I'm gonna take these off for a second because I'm sweating. Woo! All right. Oh, Christina's in the UK. Lots of rain there. Whew. I'm still sweating, guys. Yes, I tried to match um, my blue with the blue that Team USA is wearing. Mm, thank you. Sandra is on fire. Awesome. If anybody has any quick questions, otherwise, guys, I want to let you know, if you are following my monthly calendar, it's going to go out tomorrow, probably tomorrow night. I know tomorrow is the first, but we technically start on a Monday. I'll try to get it out earlier because I know for some of you, Tomorrow will be Monday, <laughs> depending on where you are in the world. Um, so yes, make sure that you, if not, if you are not getting my monthly calendar, make sure that you are on my email list. The link should be in the description below, I believe. Um, yes, or you can just go to bodyproofbaby.com and it will pop up. Um, to join the community. And if you want some more support and accountability, join us in the Body Fit Athletic Club. So um, a lot of you guys are here today, Heather and Lori and Aaron and Chelsea and a lot of uh, our regulars in the club. You guys, we have so much fun. We've become like a big family where we all know each other. We all support each other through 
you know, the hard times when we're feeling struggle, like we're struggling with our, our fitness and our nutrition. And when we're celebrating, we lift each other up. Um, the biggest thing about the group, yes, you do get other uh, calendars and workouts and you get a nutrition plan, but you also get access to myself and to Vivian, our body fit dietitian nutritionist. So we are in the group all the time. We do events, we do lives where we tackle hot topics. We do lives where we take your questions. So we are there to give you support. So that is the idea of the athletic club is that if you want to get connected, I can get to know you and help you on more of a personal direct level. That is the place to be. But honestly, I think the best part about it is the community. Everybody is so supportive and so encouraging, and we have a lot of fun in there. So join us if you can. You can still use the code show up for $10 off the monthly or body foot 100 for $100 off the yearly. Join us. Yay. Uh, Sportcaster 89. Amy, how do you refuel after your workouts? Listen, I always just try to make sure that I'm eating something within an hour. But listen, if you um, eat something before and then you know you have a snack or a meal coming up in a few hours, that's okay too. The idea is to get some protein to refuel your muscles after you've been burning through um, your carbs and your protein and your fat. So if you can get a combination of a protein and a carb, um, that's the best option. I do often do protein shakes. Um, I like a plant-based, I do a frozen banana, I do almond milk, I throw greens in there, that kind of stuff. But I don't think you need to spend a ton of money on supplements, on um, you know, super fancy, like a bunch of things to add. You can get everything you need from your food. So I try to make sure just that I get something with a little bit of protein and some carbs um, pretty soon after my workout. But it depends on what my day is like and when I work out. So um, yay, Erin, I love the Summer Olympics. Next year's Winter Olympics, yes. Fun fact, I do have a very old, old workout from 2014, from the Winter Olympics. I don't think I did it in 2018, probably because I was very, very pregnant. Um, but uh, it, it's an old one, but it's a fun one. But yes, next year we will definitely do a live Winter Olympics because um, those, those are some really fun sports. Just think of all the possibilities. Skier swings, skaters, all of that. Snowboarding looks just like you're surfing, right? <laughs> Awesome, guys. Uh, is PB&J? Yeah, that's a great option. I would make sure that you get um, peanut butter with no sugar added, just because we don't really need extra sugar. Um, and I would make sure that you go light on the jelly or make sure, again, it's something that doesn't have a ton of sugar added. Um, try to get something with no sugar added if you can. But that's a great option, because again, protein and carbs and fat, that's good. Yay, Natasha, thank you for coming. Let's see, does anybody else have any questions? Olivia, when trying to lose weight and get abs, how much alcohol is acceptable? Ooh, <laughs> that is a tough question. I would say it's like everything else, whether it's abs or not, you know, everything in moderation. I think the recommendation is one drink a day for women, and I think two for men, um, or maybe five per week. Um, I would just limit it and I would be aware of what you are drinking, making sure it's not like super high calorie or super high sugar, but it's hard um, to put a number on that because everybody is different in how their body is, is processing and metabolizing. So I would say if you can limit your alcohol consumption, maybe just on the weekends, I'm not a dietitian, but um, everything in moderation. But it's hard to say a certain number, one, because I'm not a dietitian and I'm not your doctor, but uh, moderation. And then keep up with your, your workouts, full body and core. Francis, is there a body fit by any fit fit group? I think we have one, maybe one of my, I'm not in it, uh, but I think some of the body fit athletic clubbers are, if anybody wants to share that. Otherwise, jump it if you're able to join the body fit athletic club. Um, I know a lot of people follow each other on their trackers there. So, um, Charlotte, low impact moves, uh, after rehabbing some lower back pain. Um, so I would just say taking the jumping out. If you're having a little pain, just taking the jumping. So, you know, we do these on a lot of those, you know, just instead of your full jack, modified jack, things like that, maybe taking all of your lower body, your squats to just body weight. Squats and lunges take the weight out so you're not tempted to lean forward. Tons of different options for that, but um, I would definitely also say those bird dogs that we did, how about I just show you, are great 
for strengthening the lower back. And then also your cat to cow, cat cow here. I'm pretty tight in my lower back as well, so I try to do that one a lot. Um, and that swimming, if you can do that swimming that we just did, just very gently and slowly, um, then I would say that's a great one as too. Katie said that was fun. She's proudly repping Alberta, Canada. Yes, our Canadian neighbors. Woo, am I missing anything else? A sportscaster, what workout am I posting on Monday? You will have to join my mailing list to see, but I will tell you that it is edited and ready to go, and it is a fun one. So um, it will be, you know, as we've been doing, it will be with weights, kettlebell, dumbbell, full body strength and cardio, but I'm excited about this one. So make sure you're on the mailing list that you get the calendar. Yay, all right, team. I'm gonna go eat some food and hang out with my family and my sister is visiting. Thank you guys so much. This was such a fun workout to do with you. We'll do more silly workouts like this as well because as you can tell, they're still challenging. Have a great day, everybody. Keep watching the Olympics and supporting all of the countries around the world. I will see you guys soon. Thanks for joining.